Okay, now that we have learned about location vocabulary, we're going to look at it in Google Earth. And notice I've got the grid lines turned on. I did that by hitting view and then turned on the grid. I also have the status bar turned on so you can see your absolute locations coordinates in the bottom right hand corner of the screen. Okay, so right now I'm starting off where the prime meridian and I'm going all the way to the North Pole. Now that is a line of longitude and it is zero degrees uh, east or west, right? Because it's right in the middle. And as I follow down the prime meridian, on this longitude line, it goes all the way through Europe. It also goes through Africa and through the Atlantic Ocean into the Southern Ocean down to Antarctica, where it makes it to the South Pole. So that is one line of longitude and all the other lines that run north and south as circles around the globe are also lines of longitude and they are measured east or west of the prime meridian. So as I come back and look at this here, you'll notice that this view each line of longitude is 10 degrees apart. So here I'm at 10 degrees east and 20 degrees east and 30 degrees east and so on. And looking at it from this distance, I'm able to see 10 degree increments. Okay, and I can spin all the way around until I get to the anti-meridian, which would be 180 degrees. And once I go past the anti-meridian, I'm now into the Western Hemisphere. No longer is a longitude line measured east, but it is measured as an, a west line. Okay, so now I am here at the equator. The equator is a line of latitude, okay? All latitude lines are parallel to each other, so unlike a longitude line that intersects, these are parallel and will not intersect. And also these are at 10 degrees. So as I'm traveling into the Northern Hemisphere, I'm at 10 degrees north of the equator, 20 degrees north. Now I'm in the south, 10, 20 degrees, 30 degrees, 40 degrees, all the way until I get to either one of the poles where it's going to be 90 degrees. So this is 90 degrees south at the South Pole. And at the North Pole is 90 degrees north. So all lines of longitude and latitude are measured in relation to where the equator is, if it is a latitude line, or the prime meridian, if it's a longitude line. So now we're going to zoom into Happy Valley to find our school. And you'll notice that we are 45 degrees north of the equator, and we're 122 degrees west of the prime meridian. And that's how you use longitude and latitude to determine your absolute location or geographic address.